Hi Internet, it's Rebecca Tennant here. I hope you guys are all doing well. Uh, it's Christmas Eve right now, so a big Merry Christmas from me. And if you don't celebrate Christmas, then Happy Holidays, whichever one that you celebrate. And if you don't celebrate it, anything, have a fantastic 2014. Um, I'm sorry that I haven't been doing as many videos as I hoped that I would by now. But I've been revising for my mock GCSE exams, which I think have gone quite well. Um, I've been trying to do some more variety with my videos. Trying to do a bit more comedy and a bit more traditional works. So for this video, I've chosen one of John of Gaunt's monologues from Shakespeare's Richard II. I've chosen this monologue because... Last month I was lucky enough to get a ticket to go and watch David Tennant in the Royal Shakespeare Company's production of Richard II. And I love the play so much that I've decided to look at the play in my spare time. And it's a fantastic play, one of Shakespeare's histories, but it can also be considered a tragedy. Uh, this monologue that I've chosen is one of John of Gaunt's from quite early in the play. And by this point, John of Gaunt's son who would later become Henry the Fourth, has been banished by Richard for, under false pretenses, and John of Gaunt is severely ill and dying. And he's asked to see King Richard, and King Richard has come. And by this point, King Richard is not a very good king. He's been listening to the flatterers within the court, which has distorted his view of the world, and it's made him feel... He suffers from hubris, and he's kind of like God in his eyes. So I hope you enjoy this, and if you like the video, please don't forget to like the video below. Subscribe, and I will love you forever. If you have any piece of, pieces of advice, please feel free to comment. Every comment is so useful to me, and I really do appreciate it. Thank you for watching my video, and don't forget, you can subscribe to me on Twitter at RT Acting. Okay, here goes. Now he that made me knows I see the ill, ill in myself to see, and in thee seen ill. Thy deathbed is, le is no lesser than thy land, wherein thou liest in reputation sick, and thou, too careless, patient as thou art, Comest thy anointed body to the cure of those physicians that first wounded thee. A thousand flatterers sit within thy crown, whose compass is no bigger than thy head. And yet, encaged in so small a verge, the waste is no whit lesser than thy land. Oh, had thy grandsire with a prophet's eye seen how his son's son should destroy his sons, from forth I reach, she would have laid thy shame to pose in thee before thou wert possessed, which art possessed now to depose thyself. Why, cousin, wert thou regent of the world? It were a shame to let this land by lease, but for thy world enjoying but this land, is it not more than shame to be shame it so? Landlord of England art thou now, not king? Thy state of law is bond slave to the law. So I hope you guys enjoyed that all. And once again, don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below. And you can subscribe to me on Twitter at RT Acting. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoy it and stay tuned for the next video. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year from me. Bye guys.